All right. You want me to read out your charges? Might as well. Unless you want me to read them. Assault with a deadly weapon. Robbery over $500. Another assault with a deadly weapon. Torture of a peace officer. Kidnapping of a peace officer. And robbery of a peace officer. Another count of kidnapping. Another count of assault and battery. Another count of a robbery over uh, under $500. Another robbery of a peace officer and false imprisonment of a peace officer. Fleeing and eluding. Kidnapping. Robbery over $500. Possession of government property. Robbery of a peace officer. Robbery under $500. False imprisonment. Kidnapping. Attempted murder in the first degree. Robbery under $500. Criminal threats. Attempted robbery. Credible threats of death for a peace officer. And... Uh, yep, yeah, that's it. You've I'm taking one. some time off for time served and uh, for your cooperation. You're looking at 1,615 days with a four hundred, a four thousand six hundred seven dollar fine. I did myself last time. Look at that. gonna be due for release on the third on the 31st of March at 6:43 p.m. Mr. Malone I will enjoy my vacation here when I come out I will tell you what kind of man I am oh I'm looking I'm forward I'm sure to I'll find God here you I know it you do. But I know I Is will there? you're gonna find me <laughs> God damn peck your head. You know how many people want to kill me, Ryder? I don't give a shit how many people want to kill you. I promise there's more than enemy want to kill you. Enjoy your stay. Prison life is life for me. Prison life is life for me. I'd rather take my chances in the shower than hear you pitch another hour. Prison life is life for me Prison life is life for me I'd rather take my chances in the shower Than hear you pitch another hour Preacher says it's a sin To lie with another man But if he saw you in your birthday suit Well I'm sure he'd understand Stand here? I have a meeting Hey, he important. Oh, mister. How you doing, miss? Great, I guess. So I just fucking choked me. I just wanted to fucking punch him in the head. I'm gonna do it. He got out. Oh, son of a bitch. He's so fancy, I wanted to push him in the fucking mud. What's your name, anyways? Wendy Wells, the infamous. Oh, Wendy Wells. You're talking to the second most wanted man crossing, apparently. Ryder Whitlock. Oh shit, you're Ryder? Mm -hmm. Oh, I was telegraphing to you. I, yeah, I seen him. <laughs> Funny. They said they was looking for you. Yeah, they got lucky. They had to send out multiple offices to find me. And they pinched yeah. me in the middle between six and six. See, that's what they did to me too. The last time they tried to hold me up here, I broke out. <laughs> <laughs> they was lucky. I wasn't headed to meet someone somewhere. I was just sitting out in the chair looking over a cliffside, relaxing. <laughs> That's how it goes, though. They get lucky sometimes. The next time I won't, get as lucky. Hey, do you got any booze on you? No, oh, unfortunately. Fuck. They had to search me a bunch of times because they were scared I was going to choke one of them out again, kill them, or cut them. Bunch See, of peckerheads. <laughs> well, I don't blame him. Last time with the Sissica that was trying to transport me, I nearly killed one of their greenhorns with my own bare hands. Really? We're going away if, well, the sheriff was on the other side of the barn and I went to go take a shortcut. I could have gone any other damn direction. I would have been free. So I pulled the sheriff off her horse. Steal it, she shoots her own damn horse down, and I'm chased down by four goddamn deputies and sheriff. For the time. Damn. Unlucky. Then again, I am lucky at the same time. Take some 
damn near half a year to catch me every time. Yeah, me too. Where's Bentley Crooks at? I heard he's in here as well now. No, he got out. He got out before I got sent up. Oh, lucky him. Yeah, they, uh, they wanted us for the same shit, but, uh. You know something funny, Wendy? What? I rode past you and your friends on that bridge by the swamp with my friend Kel West. Now you was lost because we was already being chased. When? A while back before you got taken in. Uh, you robbed a rough looking fella, my friend. Uh, uh, I was like, give me a favor. We ride together, make it up to him. Next time we steal some guns, get the first one to him. Does he idea. Does he do this kind of stuff too? Mm hmm uh, see I don't really like robbing folks who Highwaymen too. Well, That's he would have been like fine that. if I stick around, but with how one I am, I wasn't gonna find out if he was law or not. Wait, was that out by Lemoyne? Mm hmm. Across the bridge next to the swamp to cover me. Oh, I liked him. I actually liked him. I wasn't too sure on Robin. See, I asked. See, we were we was looking for two fellas who were out robbing folk. Uh, uh, with they, some people said they all were wearing yellow bandanas. Um, maybe weren't the same folk, but I asked yes. him, like, do you, do you go around robbing people? Is this the kind of stuff you do? And he said no, because I was like, well, give me your shit then. <laughs> yeah, pick a head move right there. You should have realized right then and there you ain't law because you ain't say, Saint Sheriff Department, whatever they say. Yeah. Yeah, he's, uh, he's an old timer getting back into it, he says. He wants to retire one. They have a nice little cabin next to fucking make. Yeah, that sounds lovely. It says all of his friends are dead. Real bleeder. <laughs> I'm busy out there. I live on the road. You see yeah. pecker heads everywhere. Every which direction. Do you ever go into towns that much? No. See, me neither. People don't ever understand that. No, way of the road, by the road. That's the way I leave it. Every time I go into town, everyone knows me. See, I give them my name out during robberies. I tell them I'm Wendy Wells. Cause they ain't gonna find me anywhere else. I used to not do that. But I started doing that when the law was chasing me tight. Every feather I met, I said, I have a message for you. You can remember well. You used to bring law, you used to tell them. You kick them after into more violent, I'm gonna get against the fair folks the crossing. In fact, this morning I dragged a lady across the crossing. Did ya? Ripped up, bloody. She went back to town with my message. <laughs> I love it. Mm, she's in the law. They was too scared to leave me alone with anybody. They wouldn't budge. They was watching me like all guys until they had to split up because the bank got robbed and rose in the parlor house at the same time. <laughs> one of my one of my boys actually hit the bank at Rhodes the other day. Was it the same bank robbery? Oh, it's just earlier. Right oh, just before today? I, right before I came in here. A yeah. lovely little bro ride with Malone and the rest of his friends. <laughs> Jeez, they got me up here for train robbery, they got me up here for countless amounts of robbery, they got me up here for, I think, four or five murders. Uh, Tell me, Wendy, how long have you been riding out there for, with your little gang? <sighs> over a week now. I've already been in the papers. <laughs> I've been at this for a long time. Yeah, we should ride together. Yeah. I can show you folks a thing or two. I know... God damn, Bentley Crooks ain't stopped talking about me none. I hear it. <laughs> you don't stop talking about no one none. <laughs> yeah. In fact, you may have sold me out. Really? Maybe. I don't know I yet. That. I gotta find that out. Why do you think that? Well, two Mexican fellas I ride with, the Lobo said they may have been the case. But, just hearsay. I don't know. I wasn't there. Do you know him well? Uh, pretty well. He's one of the first folk I started riding with. 
I mean, I got some family out here, but they ain't been around much, so. Wendy, do you think you can trust Bentley Crooks? It's a good question. He does he's talk a, a lot. He's a different breed. I mean, you've spent time with him. You already know what I mean. I know. But I'm a smart man. I don't go guns blazing until I know something. Right? I didn't slide the first time until I know for sure. But it's just hearsay. I ain't got no proof of it. I ain't seen nothing like that that he's done against me or anyone else, personally. That's good. But I'd say for you and me, Wendy, it's just keep my eyes extra peeling on him. He's very friendly with everyone, though. He is. Mm -hmm. Again, these Mexican fellers, these uh, the Lobos, I know them too well. Then again, they could just be paranoid. There was a few of them in here earlier. One of my, one of my Flowers friends. Flowers and Martinez, right? Uh, maybe one guy was an older fella. I don't know. Girl I don't know what their name was. No. Different, different ones. We've been around the time Bentley went, I believe. Ah, uh, yeah. See, I never met them out on the road before. They ain't bad. They're good. They do. They're careful. They're quiet. I like them. You ever ride with the, the Kelly gang? I don't know of them. Yeah. They don't like me too much. <laughs> yeah, you robbing out west ain't a good idea, usually. I heard. That's what everyone says, but that just means that everyone's got the most shit out there because no one wants to rob out there. <laughs> well, here's my thought on that. Rob another gang. You have them after you now. You also got the law after you. It'd be a pain in the ass. One will take you in and one will shoot you dead. Complicates things when you're just trying to work. Besides, you don't see people as much out west as you do out east. One after another. Busy, busy. Delivery drivers, fishermen, lawmen. Yeah, yeah I don't think they're safe. Mm -hmm. So, they ain't see it coming. We go out west, piss off too many other people. That's how I see it. Everyone out west is pretty well connected. Yeah. <laughs> I do see folks with some people out east. But I don't. They'll sell you gems, they'll buy you stolen guns, they'll help you out. They don't see where you eat. This must be one of the guards I heard about. <coughs> Is your name Booker? Right. Well, I heard you're a lovely lady. What the fuck is that on your face? Now I, now I know that's a lie. Oh. Why would the sheriff I'm lie to me? Lady, I am very much a cunt. And why are you two in the same cell? We're talking. Oh, you're talking. Oh, am I? I'm sorry, am I interrupting? Yeah, a little bit. Can you, can you go? Oh, oh. I'm sorry, I am so sorry. I, I accept your apology. Do you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wells, welcome to Sisigo. Well, don't you really like it? Oh, scared you, didn't I? Yeah, a little, bitch. What'd you say? It's a little. It need to be loaded, you know that. I'm going to Bitch. Well, nice to meet you, Booker. Yeah, it's not nice to meet you. Stand up. Mm -hmm. Put your hands up. Oh, did it hurt? Yeah. Ow. 
I'm sorry. For the just arrived just for me thank you thank you oh cigarettes i've been running low well, you can have those carrots interesting are you still over there complaining no no now, let me ask you something, inmate. Yes, ma'am. Did you think it was a good idea to have another inmate in your cell? Well, I didn't invite her. She came in on you her didn't own. invite her. You didn't think uh, to maybe tell her to go away? Well, I ain't her mom or her daddy. Are you her friend? We're acquaintances, I say. I see. I want you to go over there and kick her. What the hell? Don't kick me. Well, this is part of the game you gotta play here. Ow, we can come and gentle her. Do it again. Ow. Now tell her not to come in your cell again. Miss Wells, Booker insists you don't come into my cell. Okay, fine, I won't. Good dog. Now go sit down. 